since the dawn of the automobile, luxury models have been a symbol of status and success, and the source of countless automotive aspirations. Luxury vehicles showcase high-end amenities and advanced safety technologies, as well as the latest in entertainment features and communications equipment. Most luxury brands experienced a bit of a sales downturn in 2017 versus 2016, but if you had a positive year, Audi, Infiniti, Jaguar and Maserati grew sales in 2017, while Cadillac and Lexus both declined about 8% compared to a year ago. The top 5 luxury brands overall were Audi, BMW, Cadillac, Lexus and Mercedes-Benz. Stay tuned for a look at the best-selling luxury models of 2017. Note, given the popularity of SUVs in America, this list includes luxury cars and crossovers. 20. Cadillac Escalade, 2017 sales, 37,694, versus 2016, minus 3.6%, the largest luxury SUV on the US market, the Escalade makes a statement with its massive chrome grille, unique vertical LED lighting that projects through stacked crystal lenses, and 22-inch aluminum wheels. Although Escalade sales were down slightly versus a year ago, the big caddies sold in higher numbers than all the brand's passenger cars combined. Carrying its occupants in the utmost comfort, Escalade is available with heated front and second row seats, an advanced Bose audio system and an optional Blu-ray DVD entertainment system. Thanks to triple sealed doors, acoustic laminate glass and Bose active noise cancellation technology, the Escalade provides a quiet, solid ride. Audi Q7, 2017 sales, 38,346, versus 2016, 25.5%. Audi's flagship SUV received a complete redesign for the 2017 model year, and it appears this new look resonates well with consumers. Finishing 2017 strong with December sales up 48% compared to a year earlier, the Q7 outsold all of Audi's luxury car models, proving the importance of crossovers in the luxury market. The 7-passenger Q7 can be equipped with heated and cooled 12-way power front seats, a panoramic sunroof, a power folding rear seat and 20-inch polished finish wheels. The Q7 also features Audi's MMI infotainment and technology package, which has a high-resolution 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster that can display full-screen navigation and other selectable information. Audi Drive Select has seven driving modes, including an off-road choice that raises the ride height by 2.3 inches. 18. BMW 4 Series, 2017 sales, 39,634, versus 2016, 10.8%, one of five BMW models that are top sellers in the luxury car market, the 4 Series joined the German automakers lineup for 2014 when the 4 Series coupe and convertible replaced the two-door 3 Series variants. A year later BMW added the 4 Series Grand Coupe, which is a four-door sporting a Coupa-like profile. BMW's car sales were down overall for 2017 compared to a year ago, but the 4 Series is one of the bright spots one of two BMW passenger cars that had an uptick in sales for 2017. This may be due to the refresh the 4 Series received for the new model year, including updated styling, a stiffer suspension, revised steering, new alloy wheels and new exterior colors. 17. Infiniti QX60, 2017 sales, 40,444, versus 2016, minus 4.0%. The QX60 is Infiniti's family-friendly three-row crossover that debuted for 2013 as the JX35 and was renamed QX60 for the 2014 model year. Although sales were down slightly for 2017, the QX60 is one of Infiniti's best-selling models, moving a mere 300 units less than the top-selling Q50 sedan. Last year the QX60 received revised exterior styling that reflects Infiniti's new design language, including a new signature grille, headlights, turn signals and new wheel designs. The QX60 also received a power boost for 2017 via a 3.5-liter V6 engine that now produces 295 horsepower and 270 pounds-foot of torque, mated to a continuously variable transmission. 16. BMW 5 Series 
2017 sales, 40,658, versus 2016, 25.5%. BMW's mid-size luxury sedan started the 2018 model early with a complete makeover. The 7th generation 5 Series uses aluminum, magnesium and high-strength steel to improve handling while reducing weight. This updated 5 Series is quite popular with consumers, finishing a strong 2017 with a 124% increase in December versus a year earlier. The 5 Series is available in multiple configurations including the 530i Performance Sedan. 530e xDrive i Performance Sedan and the M550i xDrive. 15. BMW X3, 2017 sales, 40,691, versus 2016, minus 7.9%, coming off a record sales year in 2016. BMW's compact crossover experienced a slight sales dip in 2017 yet still recorded its second best annual sales. The continued success could be attributed to the all-new 2018 X3 that rolled out last fall. With more aerodynamic styling and a freshened interior including a large 10.25-inch touchscreen display, the X3 is produced alongside the rest of the BMW X lineup in Spartanburg. South Carolina. BMW also added a new M Performance version of the X3 for the first time. The X3 M40i gets a 355 horsepower turbocharged engine that can push the small crossover to 60 miles per hour in 4.6 seconds. 14. Infiniti Q50, 2017 sales, 40,739, versus 2016, minus 7.4%. Infiniti began a complete refresh of its model lineup in 2014 with the Q50, which replaced the G sedan. Sales peaked in 2016, and even though sales dipped only slightly last year, Infiniti gave the Q50 a quick refresh to keep momentum going. The 2018 Q50 receives updates to front and rear styling as well as some improvements inside the cabin. The Q50 offers a choice of four different powertrains, ranging from a fuel-efficient hybrid to a high-performance twin-turbo V6 that can produce as much as 400 horsepower in a limited-edition Q50 Red Sport 400. 13. Mercedes-Benz GLC 2017 sales, 48,643, versus 2016, 1.6%, Mercedes-Benz introduced the GLC crossover in 2016 when it replaced the GLK. Not only was 2017 the GLC's best sales year on record, December had a 53% increase over the same month in 2016. GLC sales were also far above the levels that the outgoing GLK ever achieved. The GLC is available as a standard crossover or as the GLC Coupe, which is sleeker and sportier than its crossover sibling. Last year Mercedes-AMG added to the GLC lineup with a high-performance GLC 63, which boasts as much as 503 horsepower. The GLC also is one of the safest vehicles in America, earning a top safety pick plus rating from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety. 12. BMW X5, 2017 sales, 50,815, versus 2016, 6.7%, as BMW's first sports activity vehicle, the X5 debuted for the 2000 model year and has evolved over the last decade into one of the most popular luxury SUVs in North America. The X5 had a strong showing in December up almost 10% compared to the year previous which helped it achieve second best annual sales since its introduction. The X5 is designed more for on-road performance and is available with a range of power plants including a potent yet fuel-efficient plug-in hybrid that can produce up to 308 horsepower and as well as travel up to 14 miles on electric power only. 11. Acura RDX, 2017 sales, 51,295, versus 2016, minus 2.0%. The RDX debuted as a 2007 model joining the larger MDX, and in 2016 the premium crossover received a facelift including Acura's new three-dimensional grille treatment, Acura signature jewel LED headlights, LED taillights with light pipe design, 
and more aggressive lower front and rear fascias. Sales of the RDX had been climbing steadily since it debuted, but a drop in December of almost 20% compared to a year earlier resulted in a slight decline year over year. We expect to see a bit of recovery from RDX since a redesigned model should arrive sometime later this year. 10. Mercedes-Benz E-Class 2017 sales, 51,312, versus 2016, 0.8%. Mercedes-Benz introduced an all-new E-Class sedan for the 2017 model year, joined by the coupe early last year. The updated model has done well for the brand. Although sales are basically flat for the year, December ended with a healthy 11% increase versus the same month in 2016. The 10th generation E-Class boasts a new exterior design, a luxurious new interior and some world premier technologies. The E-Class also is one of the safest vehicle in America, earning the top ranking from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety. 9. Lexus ES, 2017 sales, 51,398, versus 2016. Minus 11.8%, the ES is the entry-level model of the Lexus lineup, and wears the crown as the brand's best-selling passenger car. Even though the ES received bold new styling in 2016, sales have been declining. December numbers revealed a reduction of almost 20% versus a year earlier. Available with a V6 or fuel-efficient hybrid power plant, ES standard equipment includes the Lexus Safety System Plus package consisting of the pre-collision system with pedestrian detection, lane departure alert with steering assist, intelligent high beam and high speed dynamic radar cruise control. 8. Mercedes-Benz GLE, 2017 sales, 54,595, versus 2016, 5.4%. When it debuted as a 1998 model the M-Class was one of the first luxury SUVs, and in 2016 it was renamed GLE Class to align with other Mercedes-Benz SUV monikers. At that time the GLE also received fresh styling and new features, and it has clearly resonated with consumers. Sales of the GLE Class are up overall in 2017 making it not only the best sales year for the GLE, but it also beat annual sales figures of the M-Class over the last 15 years. A few GLE variants are available, ranging from the GLE 350 powered by a 302 horsepower 3.5-liter V6 engine with rear-wheel drive or 4-matic all-wheel drive, to the outrageous Mercedes-AMG GLE 63S coupe powered by a 577 horsepower by turbo 5.5-liter V8. 7. Acura MDX, 2017 sales, 54,886, versus 2016, minus 1.1%. The MDX is Acura's best-selling model, outselling all the brand's passenger cars combined. Acura delivered a refreshed MDX for the 2017 model year sporting updated styling headlined by a new Acura Diamond Pentagon grille. This new MDX went on sale in mid-2016 and was joined last year by the innovative MDX Sport Hybrid. The MDX Sport Hybrid uses a 3.0-liter V6 engine team with one electric motor on the front axle and two additional additional electric motors on the rear. Total output is 321 horsepower, while handling is further enhanced by the system's ability to direct power to individual rear wheels. 6. Audi Q5, 2017 sales, 57,640, versus 2016, 16.3%. Small crossovers continue to gain popularity, and just about every car company is getting in on the action. The Audi Q5 is an excellent example as the best-selling model from a company that until 10 years ago didn't even offer an SUV. Building on the success of the Q5, Audi has recently introduced an all-new 2018 Q5 with styling cues from its larger Q7 sibling including the single-frame grille flanked by stylish LED headlights. In addition to the updated styling, the Q5 is larger in nearly every dimension while weighing about 200 pounds less. With improved aerodynamics, an updated quattro all-wheel drive system and a stronger chassis, the Q5 should deliver even better driving dynamics than its predecessor. 5. Lexus NX, 2017 sales 
59,341, versus 2016, 8.1%. Lexus joined the burgeoning compact luxury SUV segment when it introduced the NX for the 2015 model year. The NX has proven quite popular with sales increasing every year since its inception, making 2017 the small crossover's record to beat. The NX is available with the first ever turbocharged engine in the Lexus a 2.0-liter four-cylinder that produces 235 horsepower and 258 pounds-foot of torque. Also available with a hybrid powertrain, the NX X300H is one of the most fuel-efficient SUVs in America. 4. BMW 3 Series, 2017 sales, 59,449, versus 2016, minus 15.6 percent. Not only is the 3 Series BMW's best-selling model line in America, the German automaker has sold more than 14 million units worldwide since its introduction 40 years ago. Currently in its sixth generation Kata named F30 the 3 Series is available as a sedan, wagon and Grand Turismo 4-door hatchback. Two-door and convertible models are now named the 4 Series. The entry-level 3 Series is the 320i with a 2.0-liter engine generating 180 horsepower. The BMW 3 Series is available with all-wheel drive and a variety of engines, including a plug-in hybrid in the 330e as well as a 320-horsepower turbocharged engine in the 340i. 3. Cadillac XT5, 2017 sales, 68,312, versus 2016, 73.0%, an all-new model for 2017. The XT5 replaced the SRX crossover, and the new model quickly became the brand's best-seller. In fact, Cadillac reported its second best sales ever thanks in a large part to the popularity of the X-T5. With a unique chassis and structure, the X-T5 is lighter and stiffer than the SRX while offering a roomier interior. Featuring fresh styling inside and out, the X-T5 is well equipped with contemporary high-tech features including Apple CarPlay, Android Auto and the latest version of Cadillac's Q interface. Available with front or all-wheel drive, the X-T5 gets motivated by a 3.6-liter V6 engine producing 310 horsepower. 2. Mercedes-Benz C-Class, 2017 sales, 77,477, versus 2016. 0.4%, with an expanded lineup that includes a coupe and convertible in addition to the four-door sedan. The C-Class is doing quite well in the tough luxury car market. Even more surprising, the C-Class maintains its place as the top seller in the Mercedes-Benz lineup, outselling the brand's crossover SUV offerings. The C-Class's success has helped Mercedes-Benz achieve its place as the top-selling luxury brand in America for 2017. Equipped with rear or formatic all-wheel drive, Drive. The C-Class is available as the C300, the C350e plug-in hybrid or the more powerful AMG C43 and AMG C63. 1. Lexus RX, 2017 sales, 108,307, versus 2016, minus 1.0%, redesigned for the 2016 model year. The popular Lexus RX tops the Lexus charts with sales that are considerably higher than all other models in the lineup. One of the first luxury crossovers when it debuted as a 1998 model, the RX combines the utility of an SUV with the ride and comfort of a luxury sedan. The updated look features an aggressive grille, the overall design has more sharp angles, and the blacked-out C-pillars create a floating roof effect. Inside, the RX is optimized for five occupants. A larger seven-passenger version will join the lineup later this year, 